This is the Ibanez Q series. It's their brand new exciting range of high performance guitars with modern up to date specs that are designed for playability and versatility. Now we're really looking forward to this because we are one of the first in the UK to be given these guitars. Thank you to Ibanez. So we're going to give them a run for their money and we're going to hopefully answer some of the questions that you may have about them. But don't get too excited just yet. Let's not lose our heads. So why would you want a headless guitar? Well, they're lighter for one, they're more portable, which makes them perfect for traveling musicians. And as well as that, you don't get any of the sympathetic resonance of the strings behind the nut when you're playing chords or tapping, particularly if you have a really clean sound. Plus, they look pretty cool too, let's face it. So with that said, how do these Q-series stack up to other different headless guitar models? What we found is that they're surprisingly resonant, particularly compared to other lightweight guitars and certainly other headless guitars as well. When you strum chords unplugged, you really feel the vibrations of the strings running all through the body and up through the neck. This is gonna have so much impact on the resonance and the sustain of the guitar. And it certainly helps that they are all fitted with roasted maple necks as standard, which is only gonna help this. Another thing that sets this guitar apart from other headless guitars certainly is the bridge. Now it's designed specifically by Ibanez to handle wider intonation so that you can change tunings a lot easier and as well as that string changes are an absolute breeze. Not only that but you can use pretty much any brand or gauge strings that you like. You don't need to get any special types or double ball ends that you have to perhaps on some other headless guitars. We also found that the tuners are a lot more comfortable to use than other headless guitars. They're spaced out pretty well, so you're not getting kind of your hands stuck too much when you're rotating them. And the actual rotation itself is a lot smoother and a lot less stiff than some other headless models on the market. The Wizard Neck makes technical high speed playing really comfortable and on some of the models you also have slanted frets which I should point out at this point is not multi-scale but they are slanted all down the neck on the same scale length and that angle is added for extra comfort and playability particularly when you're using complex chord shapes or something like tapping it's going to make that a lot easier.
Well, the pickups are custom designed by Ibanez and they are incredible. The voicings are amazing. You get really chunky humbuckers. The single coils are nice and crisp and every guitar has got a switch on it that changes the voicings on all the pickups so you get much more added versatility with the sound. The HSS models with single coils in them replicate that classic Strat sound really well. And as always with all Ibanez guitars, they hold up pretty well to higher gain too. It really is no wonder as to why they've brought in a guitarist like Echika Nito as an artist with a signature in this range, because these guitars are perfect for players who use all kinds of alternative methods to play, like tapping and complex chords, etc, etc. The Ibanez Q series goes far and beyond just being another range of headless guitar models. Initially, before we got our hands on these guitars, we just thought they were going to be a series of headless guitars with nothing particularly special about them. But how wrong we were. These things are absolutely incredible. We honestly did not expect them to be this good. They are the real deal and Ibanez have absolutely knocked it out of the park with them. thoughts on these. Are you a headless guitar fan? Have you got any questions about this Ibanez Q series range that we perhaps haven't answered in this video? Drop us a comment and let's start a discussion about them. Thanks as always for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, subscribe to see more content like this in the future, and we will see you very soon.